if you're looking at github free version and github pro version you're in the right place you're wondering which one you should be using and which one's going to be benefiting you the best well we're going to go through both versions and see which one is the better option so let's dive in so what is github well, github is a web-based platform that provides version control and collaboration features for software development projects using git it allows developers to store, manage, and track changes to their code repositories, as well as collaborate with other developers on projects. So let's have a look at some of the free features. GitHub offers a free plan that includes the following. It includes unlimited public and private repositories, unlimited collaborators for public repositories, a gig of storage, and a 100 meg per file upload, basic features like pull requests, issues, and wikis, GitHub actions for CI and CD with 2,000 free minutes per month, GitHub's Pro features, however, include all of the previously mentioned, plus unlimited private repositories with up to three collaborators, two gig of storage with a hundred megabyte per file, GitHub Actions with 3,000 free minutes per month, GitHub Packages with 500 meg of storage, priority support from GitHub, and access to the GitHub Pro community forum. So who is each plan's target audience. Well, GitHub Free is ideally for individual developers, open source projects, and small teams working on public repositories. It provides a solid set of features for basic version control and collaboration needs. While GitHub Pro is suitable for developers and teams who need more advanced features and support for private repositories. It offers additional storage, GitHub's action minutes, and priority support making it a good choice for professional developers and small businesses. In conclusion, ladies and gentlemen, GitHub offers both a free and a pro plan, so to cater for everyone's needs. The free plan is great for individual developers, and the pro plan provides additional features for the developers and teams working on private repositories. If this guide was helpful, go ahead and drop us a like, and we will see you next time.